Hi, Chris from Regal Rexnord here with your Motor Minute Tech Tip, helping you become a motor pro one minute at a time. In today's Motor Minute, we will answer the question, what is the difference between a 42 and a 48 frame direct drive FHP motor? You know, 42, 48, whatever it takes. Direct drive fractional horsepower FHP motors are commonly used in residential and light commercial indoor blower motor and outdoor fan motor applications. Direct drive FHP motor frame ratings are often listed on the motor rating plate. However, few people know what they actually mean. The frame rating of electric motors are regulated by NEMA, the National Electrical Manufacturers Association. Looking at the chart below, we see motor frame dimensions fall into basically four frame ratings or categories according to NEMA, 42, 48, 56, and T-frame. There are many rated dimensions for each frame rating. However, only two of these ratings commonly apply to FHP direct drive motors. The two dimensions that commonly apply to 42 and 48 frame FHP direct drive motors are the U dimension, the shaft diameter, and the BD dimension, the width or diameter of the motor. Common 42 frame FHP direct drive motor dimensions include the diameter of the motor, approximately five inches, and the shaft diameter, 3 8 inch. Common 48 frame FHP direct drive motor dimensions include the diameter of the motor, approximately five and a half inches, and the shaft diameter, one half inch. You may also have noticed that some frame ratings are followed by a letter. This is the NEMA frame suffix. The letter Y denotes that the motor has a special mounting type, also referred to as a non-NEMA standard mount. The standard mounting type for NEMA rated motors is a welded rigid base. Any motor that does not use this type of mount could be listed with the suffix Y. Identifying the motor frame size, shaft dimensions, and mounting type are important when replacing motors. Some of this information may be provided in the frame rating on the motor rating plate. However, most of this information must be either measured or visually confirmed to select a replacement motor that not only operates properly, but also mechanically fits the application. And that's a wrap on this segment of Motor Minute. Remember, we provide motor training and product information in multiple formats, including videos, literature, podcasts, articles, of course, Motor Minute technical tips, and classroom education, both online and face-to-face. -face. All of this industry-leading training is available at no charge to HVAC professionals at regalmmu.com. Thank you for taking the time to build your motor knowledge.